Welcome to this video guys. Let's see how we can publish a React app to Versa so that you can share the link with your friends or you can just make your website live. Okay, so I have the sample React project here. Let's run this to see what it is. Okay, so the React app is now running and this is basically a sample project that says welcome to my React app. This is a sample React project. Now, how do we publish this to Versa so that we can share the link with everybody and the website is actually live. So the first thing is we will be using GitHub to make our project public. So we will need to push this project to GitHub. So I'll show you how we can do this quickly. And if you want a full tutorial, check the link in the description. It will show you a full tutorial on how to push projects to GitHub. First, I'll go to GitHub and I already have this sample project or sample repository created here. I'll copy the link, go back here and then initialize a git repository in your local project and then add all the files and enter a commit message that says you can put any message here i'll just write initial commit and now the local repository has been created we need to add the origin that is this url here and just add this command git remote add origin and hit enter again if you are confused by any one of these you can check out the full tutorial on using git with vs code and pushing projects to github in the link in the description below and after you have added the remote repository you can just push your project there and the command is git push origin master or main okay Let's push to master. So this main branch is not present here in the remote repository. That's why we could not push. Now you can push to master branch that is present by default in our local project here. So if I check git status, as you can see, I am on master. That's why we could not push this main branch. Okay, now once you have pushed it to GitHub, let's go to Vercel and here click on continue with GitHub so that you can get your projects from github directly to Vercel. now if this is your first time it will ask you to authorize and authenticate just click on allow and then you will be here inside Vercel. now here click on add new on the top right click on project and here you will see the option to import from grid repository now we will import our project from this repository if i reload this you'll see that the project from our local computer has been pushed to this repository as you can see the project is here and now click on add github account click on your account name you can allow all repositories or you can only allow selected repositories so i'll just give permission to the current repository that is the one the sample react app and just click on install and now Vercel will pull the project from github to Vercel. if you are asked for the password enter your github password and click on confirm and now as you can see your sample react app project is here in Vercel. now click on import and you can change the name from sample react app to something else in Vercel. now one thing to keep in mind is this is my root project all right so I am inside my repository and my project files are inside this folder name or inside this repository directly. Now, if your project is inside some other folder, you will have to change this from root directory to something else. So as you can see here, I have two folders here, public and SRC, that is source. And both of those folders are available here inside this. But since my project is inside the sample React app folder itself, I will not choose any one of these two. I'll just have this one chosen by default. But if your project is inside some other folder, you can choose that folder. And as you can see, the React logo is also shown next to it. So I'll not change this and just click on continue and just click on deploy. Now it will take a couple of minutes and after that your website will be live for public. You can see the progress, the deployment has started and the build process is complete. Finally, our website is live and as you can see, the sample or the front page of your website will be shown here. And now you can click on continue to dashboard and your domain name is here, sample react app dash ecru dot versel dot app. You can click on this and you'll be taken to your website. Now this is the URL that you can share with your friends and yeah, now your React app is public using Vercel. This is how you can deploy your React.js applications to Vercel. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.